And then uh, Nerds, Geeks, and Gamers, Christmas. And GG versus TR Zamba. And this is going to be one sight to see. It's going to be a battle of two of the top players in their regions. Christmas very, very respectably in the PR. As well as Zamba in the Staten Island PR. So both these players are trying to make a statement, trying to make their mark and their way into winner's finals. And All right, already started yeah. off with a great parry into 70%, gets a half ink on. This is going to be uh, <laughs> Crash and Barry's team. Anyways, yeah. <laughs> uh, a, a, lot of his, a lot of this match is going to be anti-airing Rob. So Christmas is going to try and, hopefully going to try and play a very grounded game and try and force, uh, force Zoomer into jumping. Yeah, and right now we see both players holding on by a thread. Very, very even to start off this game in the first 30 seconds. And you see um, both players just trying to maintain center stage. You see both players fighting in the stage. And now on the spacing game is coming into Zamba's favor. But now letting Christmas get in his face. And what could potentially be a scary get? You know, letting Christmas get in your face is just mm -hmm. scary enough. But once he starts getting these conversions, these mix-up, these grab combos, whether it's up air into nair into oh forward throw, you don't right. see that very often. And also the roller is a key effect too. For that for that forward throw, he's trying to go for a di down mix up because uh, if he gets a techno tech situation, he can actually tech chase the, with the um, with the uh, roller and get the berry. All right, good stuff to Zama. Get again that up throw, waiting on the ground, trying to get Christmas to slip up, but Christmas such a calculated player, really knowing what Zama's going for. And speaking of those jump call outs. Christmas taking the first talk with yeah. only 92% on the board. So that's a couple hits he can take with, without any repercussion. I Good parry, but no you mentioned it before. It was a really calculated um, player in Christmas, and he calculated that up air to perfection. And now the calculation continues because these strings that Christmas is able to pull off, you don't see many Inklings pull it off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he, he's the master of his craft, really pushing the uh, Inklings combo metagame. All right, so a lot of uh, this is where the spacing games played the most is because. Every interaction right here, especially when Rob's at a, uh, at a uh, deficit, means the c could mean the game. Oh, and chasing him down with the roller. I love these edge guards coming in from Christmas. He knows how to utilize that splat bomb into that down smash. And I don't know why his opponents always fall into those traps, but it's just so good. It just shows, goes to show you how good his edge guarding game is, his ledge trapping game is. Because of down smash being so big, actually, that does cover pretty much every option. There's there's only like small little gaps where you can like either neutral get up through it or attack get up uh, and try and clank with it. So that's why he does go for it. Oh. It's one of the best traps in the game. Speaking of traps, he he catches the end of the uh, end of the side B to hit him with the forward smash. I'm surprised um, that Zamba's not going through any PTSD after what we witnessed from Fireside with that yeah. Rob side Unfortunately, B. falling out of the side B. Yeah. Finally getting the first knock of that back here. He's, he's doing pretty good. I feel like he's starting to figure out what Christmas is going for. Uh, and he's, he himself is playing a little bit more grounded as he's getting comb air comboed. The air wobbles are real. All right, so gets the up till up, up here. Up air, yep. Trying to get him to go for ledge. Gets hit by the splat bomb. What a great drift on the up B. Barely out space in the, uh, the forward air. That could have killed if it was um, if it was sweet spot. Good stuff, Christmas. No one, no one about the down throw, um, so the back throw down, uh, gyro. Once again, the splat bomb into down smash. Zamba able to run away from it this time, but at 116%, holding on to that last stock by a thread. And he has to find a way to seal this yeah. second stock from Christmas if he wants to get himself back in on the board. Wow, what a down zone. Can he survive this? So barely the bottom blast zone. He's, he's kind of caressed it real quick. All it takes is one nice edge guard, but in this scenario, we're going to have to say hello to game two and yeah. hope that Zamba can pull off anything in, into game two. Shaking his head, he's like, because mentally he started making those uh, those adaptations and he started coming back. Yeah, he did really well in, you know, in, tr in terms of trying to make the comeback, but unfortunately for Zamba, it seemed a little bit too late. He was hanging on to that last stock with 100% as mm -hmm. he sealed that second stock from Christmas. So understandably, Christmas takes game one. Something I've been seeing a lot is like he just he's been going for the up smashes out of the down, uh, out of the down throws. He yeah. needs to start reading for Christmas's mash. Cause like Christmas is just getting out of there pretty much immediately. Yeah, right away. Christmas starting off with the up throw up air combo to start off this, you know, uh, very very intense set I should say. Yeah. He, uh, so Nair, if the DI in, you can true combo up air off of it. It's something very good for Rob, but a lot of people are gonna know the DI way, so you can't get too much off of the DI way. You can get like fairs at these low percents. Yeah, and you see right now these little little conversions from Zamba 
adding 75% on yeah. Christmas already. It wow. seems to be, you know, a battle of who can attack first and get these strings going. And now if you're not going to let this man touch the floor, you're wow. going to have to say hello to the heavens and lose that first stock as Christmas will be resurrecting back with two stocks. To going for the uppies so that he can continue to save his double jump. So that way, like, if Christmas decides to go high for a roller or something, he has that double jump to immediately kind of just teleport and follow him really quickly. Oh, Finally again, though, no. even out the matches. Sama not looking too happy about it. He's like, all right, you know, I died to that, but I shouldn't have. Yeah, unfortunate. Right. Wow, gets the grab from the double forward here. This could be huge. 55% and climbing, but Chris is coming back with the, the double in there. Good air dodge in the ground to reset the scenario. Yeah, both players just hanging on to their stocks as much as they can, fighting for their lives. Christmas with a full ink to work with, so yeah. that's something to keep in mind. He can utilize that ink to his advantage the whatever way he wants. He's side B coming out and definitely not going to do anything. He is going to get hard punished for it. But yeah, speaking of ink, there have been a couple times where Christmas, especially when like in those more aggressive matches where Christmas is uh, kind of like th uh, kept to low ink and he'll right. like th he'll, he'll try to throw a splat bomb when he doesn't oh, have enough Oh, and he gets the dies. snipe. Yeah. I'm sorry to cut you off, but that snipe was cut to perfection to seal that stock from Christmas. As Zamba seems to be trying to find a way to run away with this, but he needs to deal up some damage before he has to say bye bye to the second Doesn't stock. Doesn't get both hits up here, so barely not killing. Yeah, the extra damage that you do get for them from that first hit means a lot. Oh, and he gets it this time. 150% on Rob to lose that stock, but 23% of extra credit already dealt on Christmas and then some. Let's see if Zamba can run away with this before Christmas responds I, back. He has he has Christmas in the uh, uh, on the ropes, kept in the corner, but Christmas fighting his way as he always does out of the corner. What oh. a great drift! Yeah, doing those uh, those. Staggered upbeats actually saves on gas, yep. as well as allows you to kind of hover around and oh! find your space better. What a and great it also barrier. Saves Taking a lot. him at 70 before yeah. hit. Good stuff from Zamba. Just good awareness. Getting that normal get up from Christmas. Sealing that stock. And not a very convincing way to go, but you know what? Zamba takes what he can and... Yeah, you, you, yeah, take, every, you take every opening you, uh, your opponent gives you, and you need to maximize it. That's what these good, these, these high-level players can are really great at doing is they, they see the tiniest of openings and they already have the perfect punish, uh, or at least a good enough punish to get the most out of the the, uh, the situation. Man, it's just, good. it's just good to be back, seeing these players back doing what they do best every Monday nights, guys. It's just good to be back, man. Fusion number one, and it start off with a bang. Yeah, hey, like, what we're seeing different from game one is that he's doing such a much, uh, such a better job of, like, Ooh, wow, <laughs> he died mad early. Zama doing the Zama right now, putting his hand up in frustration. But, like, as I was saying, he's was, he was doing such a good job at, like, kind of juggling Christmas, and then he just died to down to, to down air at, like, 50. Yeah, good stuff. Very unfortunate early kill. All right, he tries to space that air on shield. Not quite, though. Can he get the second upper? Burner boost. Very rare to, uh, to be seeing that, but quite the good tech. As we saw, he kind of zoomed into him. I like the zoomer he is. All right, shield, shield's in there, but tries to go for the early, uh, the early uh, shield grab. And both these players just throwing out smash attacks, and um, yeah, Zamba needs to do something now before Christmas just runs away with this game three. Yeah, bo yeah both players are really fishing for these kills. And with great reasoning too, you know, Christmas can just do whatever he wants. He can play aggressive, he can play defensive, he can do whatever he wants because at this point, Zamba has to approach, Zamba has to seal this stock. He's sitting at 176%. And wow. even in that yeah, case, he's getting the scooped right now. Bolt. Zamba's like, he's really down on his luck. He died early, and like that, all that mental damage he took uh, is really getting to him. Wow, he almost got bridged across the oh. stage. Finally, though, the, the, the down air. <laughs> Good stuff from Zamba there, and that could probably be the momentum that he needs to get back in this yeah. game. It is, you know, he's down, but he's definitely not out. And a character like Rob can put on a display and a good showing for us, like he is right now. Mm -hmm. What a, what a great gyro combo coming out from uh, Zamba. All right, so both trying to, uh, I love how Christmas is kind of hiding behind this, this platform right now, using both his bear and the platform to kind of wall out uh, Zamba to make it kind of hard for him to approach, because it will both eat uh, Zamba's lasers and Zamba's gyros. Oh, and avoiding the roller. Good stuff from Zamba, but he can't avoid it this time. He's not right. going to get, he didn't get hit by the sweet spot of it, so, you know, he gets to live to and breathe another day. What a great new air dodge coming out from that uh, in the middle of his, bur uh, his uh, burner. Down throw. Oh, back throw. a back throw. throw. Almost gets it. Kills him off a of misty eye. Tries to go for the down air. Go, goes for the, the, 
the, the safer laser there, because like he's not sure if he's gonna roll get up or neutral get up. So you don't want to risk a side B, because if he side B's here, he's dead. And now Zamba in a very bad situation. Finally takes it back yes. here. Zamba not looking too happy. He got one, as soon as he lost that first stock, the ball was in Christmas's court. He was just yeah. so much momentum from that that early down air. Yeah, good stuff from uh, both players. Nonetheless, Zamba will have to say hello to the losers bracket and. Christmas will be moving on to play Jackal later on. I don't know if we're going to get that right now on stream. But um, I think we want to run some losers as well. And speaking of losers, let me tell you about what is going on on the other side of the bracket. Colmar beating Redeemer Z. Wow. Yeah, Redeemer, Redeemer Z made it really far in bracket today. Yeah, he's been kicking up. He's definitely, I believe he's a Philly rep. So he kicked up today and he really made a statement today. And if he were to come out more to the Fusion, I would not be surprised if he puts on a better showing for